What is going on guys? We have the brand new Fusion Strike set to open on up. We have four of these single blisters or sleeved packs, I suppose is the official terminology. Got four of them to open on up to see what we get. They are pretty hit or miss with sleeved blisters and interestingly enough, I ordered six of these from the Pokemon Center via pre-order and they sent me all six uh, boltoned I'm pronouncing that right. So I definitely wish I could have gotten an art set from them, but unfortunately, I did not. So might as well open them up. Rip them from the top is what I found is best right about there. And there we go. Our first pack also has the same Pokemon. I also have a Pokemon Center Elite Trainer box that did re arrive yesterday. So, there is the code card, and as you can see, they have changed them. This is a white border, so let's keep track of the color of the borders and see if uh, they are aligned correctly to what rarity of card we get. We have our Energy, Corvusquire, Sandslash, Swadloon, Vulpix, Meltan, Toxel, Staryu, Mawile, very nice Totodile Reverse Hollow. And if you were interested, there is the set symbol. 264 cards in the mainline set. And a non hollow Absol. So it looks like if the codes are correct all the time, or at least most of the time, a white border will include a non hollow rare. And so I believe in the black border, we'll have a hollow or better. There we go, that pack opened up very nicely. Codes are almost like upside down backwards and we do have a black one. So let's see how it goes. We have a Psychic Energy, Phalanx, and all these cards, at least we have a Simus here, are pretty new to me. I haven't seen very many cards yet from the set. We got Cross Receiver, Galarian Meowth, Glossifloor, Panpour, Eevee, you can see all the Eevee cards in the background there. Ooh, a nice Shanks, which is cut funny, I'm going to look at that afterwards. A Durant is a common reverse holo, and we did get a holo Butterfree. Not too bad, and this Shinx card, I don't know how well you guys can see, you can see on the... Yeah, there you go, that is a very weirdly cut card. It looks like they were using a very dull blade, and it just did not end up cutting it. So, set that off to the side. That's very intriguing. Cool that it happened to Shinx. Oh, there we have a new pack art, Genesect. Give you guys a full, full view of the pack. We have a white code, so that would mean a non-hollow rare, but let's see if that works. We have a Fighting Energy, Sligu, Clawwitzer, Spongy Gloves, Shelmet, Drillbur, Bunnelby, Sandy Gast, a Plusle, Sigilith, Reverse Hollow, and there we go, a non-hollow Verizian. So last pick uh, pack. Open that up. There we have a Gengar. I believe currently the Gengar VMAX alternate art card is currently the most expensive card from the set, and maybe number two is the Mew alternate art. Code card, and a white one again, which means we will probably have a non holo rare, but let's see. Fire Energy. Oh, I'm not going to pronounce that. Schoolgirl, Chili, uh, Cylan, and Cress, Sw uh, Swaddle, Skarmory, Jinx, Mantine, uh, Grubbub, Mudkip, Reverse Holo, and a non holo Cloister. So, nothing crazy. We did get a Hollow Butterfree and figured out how the colored codes work. The black 
codes now are a hollow rare or better, and the white borders are nothing. Thanks for watching, guys. Tomorrow, we'll be opening up this guy.